Oh my gosh, this is my ghost in the shell moment. Oh, beautiful island. Holy crap. This is like a real... Oh. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Kimchika and we are diving into another first impressions video, this time of Paradise Killer, which is an indie game that is coming out from Kaizen Gameworks and being published by Fellow Traveler. And I'm really excited to be playing this particular demo because it is being made available to us during the week of Ludonericon, which is a digital indie games festival that focus on titles that, um, highlight and have really creative ways of looking at narrative. And so um, if you're interested, the festival goes until May 1st, Friday, May 1st, uh, 2020, and we'll be repeating every year. So if you don't get a chance to play the demos this year, do check out Fellow Traveler and the work that they do because this is a recurring event. Um, and if you get a chance before May 1st, check out a lot of the demos that they have. Um, they're all really great. I'm not gonna be able to play all of them for the channel um, video wise, but I will be streaming some of these as well on my personal channel. So um, link in the description box below if you want to check out my Twitch channel uh, and perhaps jump in on some of those. But right now and today we are playing Paradise Killer, a game that is a murder mystery. Uh, Honestly, the visuals just really struck me. I love the character design and I love a good murder mystery. So I thought, why not jump into this one? So let's do it. Okay, this is a timed and restricted alpha demo. This demo may contain bugs. Okay, so that means oh, it's just going to probably kick me out after a certain point of time. We provided a respawn feature in case of getting stuck in collision. Hold down either R or down on the D pad to respawn. Gotcha. Okay. The Syndicate created the first Paradise Island to worship their dead alien gods. Guided by leader Montserrat, the Syndicate attempt to resurrect the gods by forcing citizens into psychic worship rituals. However, the worship invites demonic corruption from beyond the stars. The islands always fail. The islands die, and a new Paradise Island is born. The cycle repeats. Oh, there's a comic book that I remember really enjoying that's about the premise seems a little it's not the same but kind of familiar in that people like worship these gods um, and by worshiping the gods they give them like the power to resurrect and be alive island sequence 13 lady love dies the syndicate's lead investigator is deceived by the god damned harmony she endangered paradise her sentence eternal exile. The island could not be saved. Demonic corruption began to infect the fabric of paradise. The island died. The citizen slaughter ritual took place. Another paradise island failed. The cycle always repeats. So I assume the same gods probably come back every time in the attempt to like recreate paradise island. Lady Love Dies watched from exile in the idle lands as each island was birthed and died. Each iteration got closer to perfection. Demonic corruption events decreased. Island 24 was almost perfect until Henry Division, a lowly citizen, got too close to the gods. He allowed demons to flood the island. The citizens were once again slaughtered and the council began their meditation to end 24 and birth perfect 25. But before they could complete it, Paradise was killed. <gasps> what? I am very into this art. Like everything about it. Everything about it. The Way of Blood Bar. Okay. Hee hee hee. The crime to end all crimes. This blend tastes different. The islands define the whiskey. This one definitely tastes of embers. She put the fire out. Was it a cosmic dream? No. They called on her. They called on her the exile. They needed to. What? Okay, so we, something shady happened at a bar. Lady Love Dies, 24th island sequence. Born at the Longest Tower, Britain in AD 1000, under the sign of Kiss Me to the Moon. Oh my gosh, I want to know the astrology of this game. 
Syndicate's lead investigator, Love Dies was exiled to the Idle Lands and the Paradise Psycho Unit was shut down on Island 13 as punishment for the Damned Harmony incident. <gasps> yes, ma'am. Lady Love Dies. Another day in exile. Something's wrong. I can feel it. Island 24 is supposed to be ending. Why am I still here? I have a bad feeling about this. Okay. <gasps> what? I thought this was just like a visual novel. I didn't know we could walk around and in first person. <gasps> I'm Lady Love Dies. What? Okay, I'm in love. Also, I love that the center, like, little heart cursor is there. All these roses. Yes. I love the flowers. I feel like... Oh. Pick up. Relic obtained. Fleeting thoughts. Lost treasures. The remnants of lives lived. A vignette of another. A window in time. Wistful photo. The outside of the Paradise Psycho Eunuch unit before it was disbanded the last photo that was taken of me back on island 13. i wonder how many years happens between each island like how long does it take for like the worship to be in like the process to happen this art style is cool like this mix of photos and like re like real photos and what <laughs> and sort of this like anime art style also I guess I should have put a warning at the start. I think there's like, there's like sexual content, crude language, brief nudity. So children, don't watch this. Shinji. Lady Love Dies. Who are you? <laughs> the first person you've spoken to in three million days. Can you taste it in the air? Oh, worried or irritated? I feel like I would be irritated if it's been three million days. Come on. Don't make me repeat myself. This feels like it's gonna be a bad day. Cool it, love dies. You're getting a call. A call? <laughs> You're in for a treat. You used to be the Syndicate's investigator, right? They're talking about you down there. They need the investigation freak. Time to get back in the saddle, get out of the idle lands, and get back to work. Exile is over. Why is a demon in the idle lands? The name's Shin Uthuk Jigoth. Jigoth? You can call me Sinji. I'm just here to hang. I got no horse in this race. What race? Someone's made a move against the syndicate. People are betting on the wrong horses. What do you want, Shinji? I like a good bit of murder. It is a good time. The best time. I'm just here to watch the results play out. You got some solving to do. Some investigating. Some looking real hard. Some good thinking. Time to weave some truth, love dies. Anyway, I gotta bounce. Go get your laptop. You're gonna need it. See you on the island. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. That little runt said I need to find my laptop. He must mean Starlight. Every investigator needs an assistant. Starlight is up by the barrier that overlooks the island. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I can go up to the barrier. I wonder if there's stairs. I wonder if there's gonna be more to explore in the house, maybe? All right, so it's interesting that a demon is, um, wow, a demon is who they sent to get me. This is cool. I'm here for this. <laughs> wow, and this is just the alpha too. I'm really impressed. Love the water sounds. I'm taking a little bit of time just to explore, just because... You never know. Although it is a time demo, so. Okay, dulled percolator obtained. Coffee doesn't taste the same if you're not working. <laughs> I'm glad that there's coffee. I wouldn't want to begin an investigation without some caffeine. Can I jump? Nope, no jumping yet. Can I dip my toes in the water? Yep. All right, let's keep a, keep a searching on for what we've got in our villa. Oh. Well-read book obtained. A well-read book about an ex-gangster that decided to become a master of grilled chicken skewers. Yum! Am I gonna get to eat a snack before going on my adventure? Is that the phone? Coming! Ah. We get to hear the voice! 
That's strange. Why is Starlight unlocked? <gasps> I love the name of my laptop. Three million days appear, now she's calling out to me. An investigator's best friend, Starlight. It's been a while since me and the girl did a dance of an investigation. The dance of an investigation. Investigation assistant, Mega Ram enhanced LLD. Oh yeah. Laptop time. The ancient nightmare technology emulator initialized. Oh dear, what's gonna happen? Welcome to Starlight, Lady Loved Eyes. Does that made the made the nightmare goat walk with you? Oh my gosh. I wish I wish it hung on to things sometimes just a little longer. A phone call from Judge is unexpected. Lady Loved Eyes, madness has overtaken the island. That happened a long time ago. The council were murdered as the new island was born. Is this a prank? Leader Montserrat is dead. The council are dead. This is no joke. A killer tried to take everything from us. The syndicate is about to collapse. You need an investigator? And you're in luck. My diary's pretty empty today. Lady Love Dies, I have authorized the use of Starlight. Take her and come to the island. Your exile is over. The prison doors are open. Cause they need my skills. I see how it is, but that's fine. Judge, the barrier's still up. Starlight can dance her way through it. Fall down to us and breathe life back into paradise. And you just want me to fall to the island? The islands haven't changed. The fall won't hurt you. But th that's just undignified. Please, provide me with a little bit of something to return to. A little bit of, I don't know, fanfare? <laughs> Step off into the abyss and drop into the island. Lydia will be waiting for you. On my way, Judge. I'll breathe life back into paradise. Fine. I can do it. Nightmare computer. I can use it, but let me do a quick scan. I'll do not too too long of a scan. I think I've gotten pretty much everything I can. We can jump with the right bumper. Alright, here we go. Nightmare interface. Confirming handshake. Ooh, a nightmare computer from the depths of space that uses a language born on a long dead world. The syndicate never upgrades. Starlight can emulate the OS and break down the components used in the symbols, but I need to work out how they're used. I haven't seen these symbols before. Looks like a hieroglyphic based language. I need to find a clue to know which symbols release the lock. I can brute force it with trial and error, but I'm a busy woman now. Starlight can see the answer. I need to work out how to make it. Some of these parts should make the symbol I need. I need to select components from the ones available and match them to the top image, completing the puzzle. Okay, so matching the top image, we've got a goat! Got him! <laughs> Hieroglyphics takes me back to university. I was the only one in that arcane text class. Looks like the language is divided into different groupings of symbols for different types of objects the civilization found important. The rest of the syndicate can't decode these. They have keys coded to the specific machines they're allowed to access. I do like that there is text saved on that sidebar because sometimes if you're reading something and you forget, it's nice to have it all there. The data on the nightmare computers is tamper-proof, sealed machines that hook into the fabric of the island. There will be more on the island I can unlock. Judge said they need me down on the island. The people that exiled me are dead, and I need to find out the who, how, and why. Time to fall into a pit of crime. A leap of faith into the sun-drenched abyss of memories, secrets, and crime. Oh my gosh, this is my ghost in the shell moment! Oh! <gasps> Beautiful island! Holy crap, this is like a re oh. Boom! Breathe life back into paradise. Oh! Wow! Here I go, falling straight down! Oh my gosh, I really hope it doesn't hurt! Hope Judge didn't lie! Okay, also the music. Paradise Gates, 24th Island Sequence. 
Unable to interface, required software not found. Please visit Starlight's inventory and install any updates. All right, Cosmos is missing. But I bet you I don't need to worry about that right now. Oh, all right, I pressed one of the triggers and it looks like, oh, it's distance and where I can find all of these really cool characters. Left bumper, hold to sprint. Hi, Lydia Daybreak. Lydia, it's been too long. I'm glad you're back, LD. Lydia Daybreak, your oldest friend. Born in Wana Falls, Kenya in AD 1001 under the sign of Beautiful Spectre. The Syndicate's fairy woman responsible for transporting the Syndicate to new island sequences. Oh, this is this lore is really cool. Like I'm getting sort of this Greek pantheon feel, but like updated, like very hip. <laughs> After an uninteresting childhood spent in worship of beautiful Spectre, she enlisted in the army during her teens. Lydia became known as a titan killer after she successfully defended a temple complex from three monstrosities born from beyond the stars. She retired from the world of assassination when she met Sam Bra Daybreak, fleeing to join the Syndicate together. Thanks, Starlight. Starlight's giving you the full 101, huh? I've been in exile for three million days. She obviously thinks I need a refresher. What did I miss? Evil stuff, LD. Last night was a killer. The council were killed just as the next island were born. Word is the killer got into their building and took a knife to him. How are you feeling? Messed up, LD. This is the worst. The island needs an investigator. Really interesting. Like, she's got, like, the kitten key, or not kitten, tiger keychain, and the barcode, like, tattoo, I would assume. Interesting. I wonder what that's from. You shouldn't have been exiled, LD. We needed you down here. Judge told me to bring you to them. An investi- Ooh. Point my finger right at you. Was it you? Are you the killer? Can we wrap this up quickly? Straight into the investigating? <laughs> nah, I was partway through a drop-off at the Paradise Gates. You can check the logs. One thing before we go, LD. I can ferry you around the island if you need me to. Save your feet from a hike. If you need a pickup, call me on one of the phones. The phones are deactivated since it's the end of the island, so you'll need to fire them up again. I already activated this phone for you in case you need to come back here. All right, fairy woman reporting for duty. Time to ride, LD. <laughs> Mashiro Heavy Industries High Grade Trans- Oh, man. Seatbelts on, LD. Whoa. <laughs> what is this? Also, I love, like, you can see yourself in the mirror. How was exile? Three million days just flies past. <laughs> Cheer up, Buttercup. You're back on the island now. Back in the game. Confident? Nostalgic. Let's go with confident. I am, I'm focused, I'm like not ready for nostalgic. I've had time to be nostalgic. I wanna get get on. Up to me to find out the truth. Criminal to catch a criminal. Ooh, do I own up to those mistakes? Or do we just say, uh -uh, I'm an investigator. I'll be contrite. You're my friend. We all make mistakes, Lydia. Chill, LD, I know. You messed up, but I understand. I don't think you're all bad. You got deceived by a god and let him just conspire to kill the entire syndicate. No biggie. We don't have any investigators except you. No offense. None taken. I like your perfume, by the way. Ah, thanks, LD. Fruity one, isn't it? It's a unique blend I got made especially. It's nice. I'll have to get some on the next island. Sorry, LD. The blend is my own secret recipe. We're almost there. You haven't even been looking at where you're driving. I guess you are basically a demigod. So, you don't have to look where you drive, I see. Go and speak to Judge. If you want to hang, I'll be on the pier. It's been so long since I've performed an investigation. Get the fire back? It never left. I was born to investigate. Go get him, LD. Reek! So, I am at a courthouse. 24th Island Sequence. Still breathing. Okay, new note added. Let's check that out. Judges summoned me. I need to talk to them. Access pending. No case files yet. No, nothing in my inventory. No population. 
Okay, timeline. Oh, wow. So there is a lot here that I'm not going to read and dive super into right now because, again, it's a time demo, so I'm a, I don't want to take too much time until we need to go through the timeline itself. But Okay, so we've got a map. Yeah, this just like sort of, uh, oh gosh, synth aesthetic, retro aesthetic. I really like it. Okay, council buildings, the crime scene, courthouse. Oh, wow. We've got a complex labyrinth of temples, graveyard, fields. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we've got a couple of different skins. Apply. Oh, I guess. Ooh. And a playlist. I am loving that so many games are doing this nowadays where you can make playlists. And what's nice is it seems like you can control the order of the songs. Play it so that, oh, oh my gosh. You can, you can control what gets played. Oh my gosh. Okay, there are a couple of games that happened recently, fairly recently, that they had such amazing soundtracks and the ability to collect songs, but you couldn't do this, where you couldn't curate your own playlist for playing. And oh my gosh, I'm so happy that they did this. Okay. Hello, Judge. Good to see Justice again. Birthplace forgotten. Birth sign forgotten. Every society needs a form of justice, and a syndicate member volunteered. They believe so deeply in impartial justice that they scrub their ego and fuse themselves to the island, becoming judge. They would become the embodiment of justice acting on behalf of the island. Starlight's helping you navigate through the sea of truth already. Whoa. <laughs> judge. You are fascinating. Paradise requires power and sacrifice. Welcome back to the bloodstained paradise, Lady Love Dies. The investigator is here. Tell me about the crime. The council are dead. Our leaders are gone. The black pall of crime hangs over us. Leader Montserrat has been taken from us. The whole council were murdered at once. They gathered to birth the new island, our perfect new home. Perfect 25. It's funny because 25 is actually my personal favorite number, so. At the end of their meditation, the killer struck. Arrogance put the entire council in one room. Hubris is a large gap in armor. If you're a murder junkie, that's quite the hit. Yeah. What time? Midnight. The holy hour. The hour of weird. The hour of judge. I, I get it. All of the council members were murdered last night at midnight. Do you have a suspect? It's a miracle. A mass murder in custody. Murderer in custody. Henry Division, a citizen possessed by a demon. He's killed before. A decade ago, he came back. We found the knife in his hand, the council's blood in his stomach. The oppressed rise up. Who would have thought? Where's the crime scene? The council's own penthouse. The brutalist tower that reaches to the sky. Has anyone been in there? The council are protected by four holy seals. Only our leaders can open them. We cannot get into the crime scene. We cannot assess the slaughter. How did the killer get in? Truth waits for you in the shadows. Truth hides behind the smoke of the crime. We only know the nature of the first holy seal. Two of the finest God Justice Marshals, stations as guards, as sentinels, both butchered by the monster. Demonic sigils cover the suspect's body, scorched onto him by the astral demon inside him. Those same sigils are daubed in the Marshal's blood at the entrance to the council building. Okay, so if no one's been to the crime scene, how do you know the council are dead? Their work is done. A new island has been born, yet they have not emerged from their chambers. The accused was found with a red, slick knife and a belly full of the blood of the council members. Did you test this blood? Just seeing. In this instance, the answer to the terrifying question is dreadful murder. Why would someone decapitate the syndicate now? Is it an interloper 
a god of desire of power? Is it naked ambition played out with a knife in a penthouse? A power play? A sicko killing? For kicks, the world's a twisted place. It wouldn't surprise me. The balance has existed for millennia. Who's running the show now? I installed architect Carmelina as the acting leader. We have birthed Perfect 25, a wonderful home of her design. She is best placed to oversee this new transition. As bizarre this violation of crime is, there is a further anomaly. Just one? You remember KHX, our master craftsman? What about him? He is missing. We haven't had any contact with him for several days. Ah, <gasps> new note added. This is doubly concerning as he designed the second holy seal that protects the council. Hmm. Suspect? See a potential killer? If you can track the right truth through the darkened forests of secrecy, you might be able to prove it. Lady Love dies. It has been a while since we needed you. The Syndicate is in danger. You're in danger. Unspoken things beyond the stars are in danger. Okay, Judge, we get it. <laughs> The island will not give up its secrets easily. What is the truth? What are facts? Are they the same? Hmm, that's interesting. So I can find facts, but does that mean I'll find truth? Perhaps not always, depending on how the investigation goes. Evidence, testimony. They are yours to find, yours to take. We must find who did this. Crime cannot hide. Crime always wants to be found. The nature of crime is perverse. Starlight has been updated with blood samples of the council and the suspect. Use them to examine the murder weapon in crime scene. <gasps> Hello! Alright, so we do have blood samples that we can analyze. I need this solved so we can move on to the new island. A suspect isn't enough. I need concrete proof. I am linked to Starlight, a conduit of justice. She, she will track your case files. She has just unlocked her suspect module. Investigate. Interrogate. Find the gold evidence in the silt of the island. When you are ready, bring them to me and we will begin the trials. The trials will determine the guilty. Assemble your facts and present truth to me. You may not understand your truths. Bring them to trial and we will reveal the guilty together and attain clarity. Interesting, so we can we can bring them facts and perhaps they'll help us find who they did it? That kind of makes me nervous because again, there couldn't be, I'm sure that if this game is as, oh, uh, as broad as I feel like it will be, depending on the facts that we find, I mean, that can interpret and create perhaps different versions of the truth. Because also the truth can seem different depending on who is telling it and who is listening. Oh, okay. There's, there's a lot of potential here, I feel like. We can start the trials whenever you are ready. They will be the climax of your investigation. But you determine when that climax will be. Are you ready to investigate? This island will try to hide the truth from you. When love dies, all that remains are the facts. Lady Love Dies! There we go, my namesake! A duel across the sun-drenched streets between the investigator and the truth. Paradise Island is yours. Crime details received. 2352, Henry Division escapes from the desolation cell. Grand Marshal Akiko, 14, was guarding him. Zero o'clock, the council are murdered. Three o'clock, or zero three. <laughs> 1203. Henry is found outside of the council building by Akiko. Akiko informs witness that Henry has been found, and the first seal guards are murdered. Akiko confirms to witness that the holy seals are closed, and she cannot secure the penthouse. Judge assumes authority over the island and locks paradise gates. Syndicate meeting is held in courtroom. Judge appoints Carmelina as acting leader. Judge decrees that he is bringing Lady Love Dies out of exile. A full investigation will happen before the island ends. Okay, so basically, in a three hour time span, the crime happened and I was brought onto the island. 331, Judge activates Starlight and waits for Lady Love Dies to make contact. 
crime details end. All right, we've got a lot of notes. Who killed the council? All right, an investigation into the heart of madness begins. Lady Love dies, must find the facts and assemble the truth. The road to her truth will be a long one. The journey will be hard. The light of her truth grows dimly, but with facts, it will shine bright. All right, power play or killing for kicks? KHX is missing. KHX is the syndicate's master craftsman and designer of the second holy seal. He hasn't been seen for a number of days, and we have blood samples. Okay, so potential leads. What is the holy seal? The council building. So we need to go to the council building just to kind of get our bearings. Um, we have a couple of folks we need to question. Crimson Acid, ooh, Yuri Knight, and Lydia and Sam Daybreak. So we, I thought we already got, I guess maybe we have to get Lydia's alibi officially now that we're on the case. Um, and we also have Witness to the End, Grand Marshal Akiko. And Carmelina Silence. Wow, these characters, I think even the thumbnails of their avatars look really cool. Dr. Doom Jazz, Henry Division, and then KJX is missing. All right. Ooh. Grand Marshal. So we have no motive, no alibi, or alibi breakers. Carmelina Silence. Ooh, Blood Dancer. Wow. Crimson Acid. Born in the hospital of our martyred goat. Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be a really, really great title to be able to just like explore the these really distinctive characters, these really memorable characters already, just through their design alone. Um, wow, there's a lot. I think anyone who's a fan of, especially like like puzzle games, mystery games, like Layton. Um, I just finished Murder by Numbers, which again, isn't the same type of gameplay because that was more of a, again, it was um, a Picross game. But I think anyone who is into that would be very much into this as well. Let us go now. We could talk to the judge. Maybe, perhaps, is there any more to investigate? Is paradise worth saving? Ooh, well, that's another question. Are you ready to start the trial that will determine the fate of the syndicate? Have you found facts and certified and crafted a truth? I'm ready to work this with you, Lady Love Dies. We shall examine your case files. Oh no, I'm not ready! This is the point of no return. Ensure that you are happy with your evidence and reasoning. There is no going back. Uh, pfft. <laughs> I've done no work. <laughs> Alright. Um... Ooh. Why me? The rest of the syndicate? Let's question. Witnesses authority. Doesn't witness to the end usually have authority at the end of an island? The remaining syndicate members are all submerged in the bubbling swamp of suspicion. This includes witness. You just took jurisdiction? I am impartial. My ego was scrubbed a long time ago. I am fused to this island. I cannot move from the Chamber of Justice. You and I are the only ones free of suspicion. You and I will understand the truths. I am almost salivating for the trial. Come back when you are ready. Why did you make Architect the acting leader? Perfect 25 is her design, her vision. The Syndicate has been mortally wounded. We cannot let them move to the New Island suffer as well. The law forbids her to be on the council. I have not forgotten her father's crimes. She's a temporary leader. We will go to the new island and she will step down. Any assurance on that? The marshals work for the council and the syndicate. They will ensure she steps down. I hope you're right. All right, so I can ask about the rest of the syndicate. Where are the rest of the syndicate? Some made it out, ferried through the paradise gates to the new island. The rest remain here, the gates sealed after the bloodbath. Are they suspects as well? It is possible they set a conspiracy in motion before they left. I doubt it, though. Criminals always return to the scene of the crime. They insert themselves into the narrative. They need to know. The rest of the syndicate are on the new island. The gates are sealed. They can't come back. They cannot revisit. I see. They can't exert influence from the new island or keep tabs on the investigation? If you commit the crime to end all crimes, you need to know how it is playing out. 
focus on the suspects here. If a conspiracy was initiated by someone who has left, a co-conspirator will be on silent. You will reveal the truth through them. Okay, so while the person, there is definitely someone that we can, is guilty on this island, there is the potential that they're a co-conspirator to someone who maybe initiated the investigation that's off the island. But again, someone here will be put to trial and hopefully it's the right person. <laughs> okay. Why me? I nearly allowed damned Harmony to wipe us out. You don't get exiled for a misdemeanor. You were the victim, not the criminal. The Syndicate is wrong to punish those that smell the rose of a god's deception. The gods are insidious, slithering into your mind. Corruption by an astral deity is not consensual. You're the only one to have ever said that. I was bound by Montserrat and the council all those millennia ago. Now I can make it up to you. Thank you, Judge. All right, so we've we've talked talked our hearts out with the judge. So now let's investigate the rest of this area. <gasps> AR mode. Okay, so we oh, there's Shinji. I kind of want to investigate. Is it come? Camellia? Carme the, the leader. A moment of your time. <sighs> what now? Am I going to be seeing a lot of you? I understand you've got a lot on your plate. Mass murder on an island full of weirdos and all that. I feel for you. I really do. Skip to the end. You know the blood crystals? That currency you guys are so precious about? I took the liberty of acquiring some while everyone was leaving. You mean... Sounds like you stole a lot of people's money. Not people, rich people. Screw them, soulless. Anyway, you need some currency to make it through this. Grease the wheels and all that. Point is, I've scattered the blood crystals around the island for you to find. A little game, a bit of fun, a little fun game. You need currency, right? Bribe a secret out of someone here, bottle of whiskey there, you know? You and I have different definitions of fun. Potatoes, tomatoes. That's not right. Catch you later. <laughs> Shinji is is a demon, but I I don't mind them so much. All right. I wonder. Oh, I want to be able to pick this up. All right. A blood crystal. One blood crystal coming right up. All right. A heart. Grotesque pyramid charms uh, obtained. Three holy pyramid charms, the gods, the syndicate, and the citizens. All right. Ooh, a phone. Can I activate this? Terminal inactive. Please insert blood crystal to reactivate. <sighs> okay, fine. Let's activate this terminal. Fast travel location outside the courthouse. Ooh, and a new skin for starlight. Mmm, whisper to the moon. What does that mean? Select your whispers. Oh, I'm excited to see what that is. All right. Verdon starlight skin obtained. Plants are very calming. We can all use with some calm. Do with some calm. All right, so. <laughs> Demo limit. Dang it. Fine. Wow. I mean, if this is... This is if this is the the amazing paradise that we can all expect. Dead Nebula, <laughs> Masara Breaker. Wow. Okay, so let's go into air mode. So we are close to. Oh yes, here we go. Yeah, I want to talk with her first. No, not you. Where are you? Not Cam Camilla? Ah, I'm just blinking. I'm there's so many new names to learn. Oh my gosh. Okay. 699 27. Okay. I'm getting closer. Do 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 do. Maybe was she on the first level? Oh jeez. My gosh. You scared me. <laughs> What's up with the birds on this island? The island's waiting to die. Our reality's broken. That makes the birds fly backwards? That's messed up. Can't say I'm a fan. 
A, a fan of what? This whole pocket of reality you've got going on? Thanks for your input. Always a pleasure. Wait, but now I want to see the birds. Keep an eye out for the birds, everyone. Do, 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 do. Ba -dum -bum -bum -bum. Ooh, investigate scene. All right, so I guess maybe instead of talking to someone, we can investigate the library first. Ooh. Chronicle of Silent Goat, a tome detailing the first god to speak to us, Silent Goat, known as the Holy Catalyst or the First. During the Great Betrayal, he was captured outside Madoha, ending in India, and tortured in the Crystal Caves. He gifted the Syndicate his dying power, allowing us to start the island sequences. But when was this? I'd love to know a timeline for that, that first island, which might have been actually in the notes, in my Starlight notes, so I can check that in a second. The Verses of the Crying Grudge, a handwritten book about crying grudge. The god was captured by the Persian army during the Great Betrayal. The near-dead god was paraded around the country and displayed above the palace in Shushtra, Shushatra Zero. The tears of the god fertilized the ground and the city became a sea of lilies. The syndicate rescued crying grudge and burned the city to the ground. The weakened god slumbers in a holy pyramid on each island, slowly regaining his strength. All right, this terminal shows the records of who accessed the library vault. The vault includes rare forbidden books, more, mostly from before the Great Betrayal in our prehistory, or from dreadful cultures on terrifying planets. The most dangerous books in here are grimoires on demon demonology. The herring tome dressed in red is a particularly dangerous and forbidden text. According to the records, a number of people access the vault over the course of the island, but the name that, it stands, that stands out is Yuri Knight. What was he doing in the vault? He accessed it several times, but mostly about 10 years ago. Okay, Yuri was one of the, so I guess maybe we're not gods, we're maybe more like demigods, it seems, because it seems like we can choose to gain these powers um, and participate in the syndicate, which doesn't seem like gods. Okay, so we can't, those are the three that we can examine. Ooh, butterflies, nice. Okay, can I jump through this? No. Okay, I'm running, 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 because I really want to find... Ooh, what's this? Ooh, another blood crystal! The goddess Blood Dancer. She gifted technology to many races and is an astral engineer without equal. She has no interest in ethics, and her experiments have caused genocides across entire planets. Wait, Blood Dancer, isn't that the one who is... blood dancer uh yeah she's the leader yee that's scary born to romero and natasha silence on the fourth island sequence under sign of blood dancer architect of the island oh under the sign of blood dancer okay carmelina all right let's see i guess we could probably activate this um yep let's activate it I guess there's no need to activate it since maybe this is a demo, but still. All right, Creeping Flora Starlight Skin obtained. Cool, cool. Hmm. Okay, 51 meters. It seems like she's upstairs. Hmm this I can insert something into the slots of this mural Ooh, okay so we'll be able to collect something and come back to that okay, it's that demon lost pain he escaped to the moon's dark side during the great betrayal he's trying to drain the moon's power to complete his resurrection you need to deal with him before that happens oh my gosh there's this whole land of demons and gods and goddesses is complex. There's a lot of loose ends. Ooh, what's this? A discarded music player. There's a data card in here. Maybe it still has some music on. New music file added! Hey! Lady Blue Vaporwave. Nice. Ooh, 
Bathhouse? Yes, please. That's fun. Use the foot bath. An oasis in this tropical heat. Spend, no, I can't take another foot bath. Oh, another, like I've had one. Oh, I can't take a foot bath. Future me will do that. Wow, there is so much here to investigate. Oh. 13th Island sequence. The shame of, oh, well, geez. <laughs> The shame of Lady Love dies. She's deceived by a damned by damned harmony. He tries to let the god hunters on the island to kill us. Praise be to the paradise trigger for saving us. Well, I have a shrine dedicated to my shame. How fun. Oh, all right. These nightmare computers can log activity in an area. They're normally set up to see us pass through a gateway or door. If I can use Starlight to help me gain access, then I might be able to gain some evidence. All right, Starlight, let's get to work. All right, and this will help us um, perhaps find a way to more quickly um, question folks. Okay, let's see. 67%, we need two upper heads as well with the ears, all right. And we've got curved horns. Okay, there we go. Doo -doo -doo. These are the logs of who entered and exited the syndicate HQ last night. There's only one route to the council building and it involves going through the syndicate HQ. If Henry did escape and kill the council, he'd have come through here. Let's see. Architect Carmelina left the HQ early through this gate. So did Yuri. Doomjads didn't leave his clinic. Henry hasn't been logged coming through this gate. This is the only way he'd get to the council building by himself. Is there another route he could have taken from his cell? Oh, dang! Okay, so my gut to maybe talk to Yuri and Carmelina was right, because those were the two that, for whatever reason, I was like, I feel like they'd be most suspicious. I have no evidence to base this on. <laughs> um, all of evidence obtained is stored in star Starlight. Case files are opened automatically as you find evidence. Starlight will link each piece of evidence to the relevant suspect in each case file. Okay, so basically we are tracking and categorization. We have to actually use our intuition and reasoning. Okay, so registering evidence, press any key to process the next evidence item. So born in Fraudal Street, Gibraltar in AD 988 under the sign of cosmic deceit. So this is our doctor, Doom Jazz. He did not leave the clinic until he was summoned by the judge. So for now, he is off of my suspect list. He has an alibi. Henry who is the current suspect, currently incarcerated in the desolation cell, doesn't appear in the syndicate log, so he didn't pass through the main entrance. This is the only way he could have gotten to the council building by himself unless he had help. And the weird one, Carmelina. Wasn't she the other one who like came? Oh, she came through, so we didn't give her an alibi. Okay, so let's back it up. We're getting close to Yuri, I think. But I really wanted to talk to Carmelina. As the leader, the the temporary leader, I think she probably could have a lot of really important things to say. Okay, 28, 27, is she in here? Maybe I'll talk to you first. Halt! What do you want, freak? Let me in to see Carmelina. Is she expecting you? I'd hope so. She should know the investigators on the island. Grand Marshal Akiko 14 is already the suspect in custody. The crime is solved. Let's not do this. Let's just take me to see Carmelina. Whatever, freak. She waits in the throne room. Okay, just put your scythe down. Just calm down. Whoa! 
Oh, she's so cool. I hope she didn't do it. Lady Love Dies. Architect Carmelina. Carmelina Silence, architect of the island sequences. Born to Romeo and Natasha Silence on the fourth island sequence under the sign of the Blood Dancer. Her parents were skilled architect island, um, island architects and taught her how to weave psychic will into structure. Carmelina has since become a genius architect and will soon achieve the perfect island. Romeo Silence was seduced by the god Cosmic Deceit and committed treason against the syndicate. Committed treason. As a part of his punishment, no member of the Silence family will ever be allowed on the council. Her mother was killed fighting to protect the council during the demonic invasion on the Ninth Island Sequence. Exile wasn't permanent for the investigation freak or her little computer. If the syndicate needs me, I'll answer. This is the worst crime in our history. Leader Montserrat and the entire council have been taken from us. Losing Montserrat to an act of savagery is a loss to all of us in the syndicate. A loss all of us in the syndicate will struggle to overcome. I wonder if though, I mean, she's not allowed to ever be in the syndicate, so there's definitely potential motive there, I can see. Promotion or vengeance? I'll be snide. Worked out okay for you. You got the throne. A temporary measure ordered by your new master. A new council will be assembled on the next island. Why did Judge choose you to assume the role of our leader? Temporary leader. <laughs> Don't forget that. The law still stands. I am a servant, not a leader. The sins of my father still bind me. That's what I don't get. Your father's punishment still stands. You shouldn't be on the throne. You're out of the loop. The next island will be perfect, and I'm the architect. I will see us to the new island and then step aside. Any guarantee of that? Law is law. The leader cannot overturn it without unanimous council backing. The marshals work for the council, not the leader. They will ensure the law is carried out. I am an artist, a craftswoman. I have no desire to manage and administrate. These concrete halls are vessels for bureaucracy, not art. I hope you can close this incident quick. Oh, her dog is also like, <sighs> this island wants to die. Perfect 25 is coming. The murderer is in custody. A legend, murderer. Do not ignore the evidence to find a truth that isn't there. I'm here to hunt the truths that haunt this island, no matter which truth you may cling to. Believe what you want. Investigator, can I help you with anything? Ooh, okay, so we now have investigation side of things. Let's see. What's your alibi? Where were you last night? Visiting witness. His role is to oversee the end of an island. The last moments are best enjoyed with an old friend. Do you often visit witness? Not in recent times. Our paths diverged. Then why last night? For so long, he's been integral to my art. Every island has failed and he has borne witness to the end of each one. This may be the last time an island ends. If Island 25 is perfect, there will be no more endings to watch. I wanted to say goodbye to old art. What time did you arrive? About 9 p.m. The logs on his apartment should be able to confirm that. Okay. Okay, we'll check that out. I'll make sure I check them. I'll save you his question as well. I left when Judge summoned us for a crisis meeting sometime after midnight. Mm-hmm. Um, can you think of anyone who would want to strike against the council? Asking such a thing is a dreadful, is dreadful, investigator. The prime suspect is behind bars and needs to be executed. All of us are loyal members of the syndicate. I can't think of anyone that would commit a crime like this. No suspicions? You have no reason to suspect anyone in the syndicate at all. Why would I? Perfect 25 is coming and we're on the verge of a new era. The future was bright for the syndicate before last night happened. Architect, what do you know about the crime last night? Only what we were told by the Grand Marshal in the crisis meeting. A possessed citizen broke free and murdered the council. Why would a citizen have enough motive and the ability to kill the council, breaching all of the holy seals? 
That's not for me to question. I'm surprised there's any question at all. So you believe he did it? Of course, and so should you. Ugh, you're a disgrace. Finish this quickly and maybe the next council will look favorably on you. Hmm. What do you know about KHX's disappearance? It's a mystery. I do hope nothing bad has happened to him. We always enjoyed talking. When did you last see him? A couple of weeks ago. My schedule became hectic as we closed down the island. Okay. We could hang out with her. What is that like? Can I ask you something, Architect? What's your dog's name? Platinum. When did you get him? This island a few years ago. During an abduction operation, a stray followed the marshals back. Huh. Dog person? I never had you down as a dog person. I thought you'd be more into cats. I wanted a companion that doesn't talk. Cats are fine, but I see too much of myself in them. Can I pet him? If you must. Who's a good boy? Are you a good boy? Can you help me sniff out the murderer? Can I help you with anything else, investigator? I'm busy. Oh! Relationship increased. Okay, so that means... Potentially... May the silent goat walk with you. And may you reach the moon. So... We have the ability to... Gain relationships with people. Befriend them. Oh my gosh, and time passes? <gasps> Whoa! That's wild. And perhaps that will affect uh, some of the investigation and the truths we're able to get. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna head back this way and talk to Yuri. I think this was Yuri? Yes. Secretary to the architect. Ooh, hi. Fashion in this game. You're the famous investigation freak. I don't believe we've ever met before. Yuri Knight, secretary to the architect and the fairy, woman ha fairy woman's handler. Born in the marble chambers on island sequence 15 under the sign of Dyer Rose. Yuri is new to the syndicate and has quickly risen through the ranks. I can't believe in our darkest hour that the judge called- Okay, you're wearing a ear pod th whatever thing. I'm already kind of skeptical of you. Uh, <laughs> snide. You're a charmer. I'm not here to make friends, freak. Evidently. I don't like sarcasm, freak. Ugh, I don't like you. I understand your secretary to architect Carmelina and Lydia's handler during her fairy woman duties. Managed to deuce that. I'm gonna be snide. I'm gonna be rude. I think I'm making a few other deductions about you as it happens. What might those be? I was raised better than that. Don't put too much faith in how you were raised, freak. It can hold you back. You broke free, didn't you? My parents were cowards. I'm not. It's not a big mystery to solve. Let's get to business. What do you want, freak? I don't like you. Stop calling me that. No mention of grieving for our loss? Grieving is a sign of weakness. I said let's get to business. Stop dragging this out. Alright, what's your alibi? Where were you last night? I was directing the fairy woman all night. Were you? We'll have to follow up with Lydia. From where? Here in the celebratory gardens. You often work in the gardens? My work last night didn't require a desk, and the gardens are beautiful when an island is ending. Any proof? No, freak. The guardians aren't covered by logs, unlike the HQ. Give me your phone, Yuri. What? I need to verify your location last night. You would have been making calls with it if you were directing Lydia. I am under no obligation to give you my phone. I have important work to do with it. It takes up but two seconds, Yuri. Not until I've finished my important work, you don't. I have jurisdiction here. I'm the investigator Judge called on. You are obliged to assist my investigation or I will haul you in front of Judge for obstruction. If you don't give me your phone, I will also assume that you have something to hide. Fine, whatever. Perfect. That wasn't so hard, was it? Just do what you need to do and bring it back. I just need to use the comms tower to verify the location of any calls made from this phone. Then you can have it back after the trial. Bye. 
All right, so let's question. Want to drop anyone in an eerie? Dish the dirt on someone? What? Who's got a motive to kill the council, Yuri? The killer's in a cell waiting to be executed. Let's say he isn't the killer. He is. It's a thought experiment, Yuri. Play along. If Henry didn't kill the council, who else has motive? Fine, I'll play along. You should investigate Crimson. You gave that name up pretty easily. I've had my suspicions for a while. Why? Something says wrong with her. Why'd she get blessed? What would stop her from wanting more power now that she's blessed? She's too smug. And you're not smug, Yuri? No! Demo time limit reached. Dang it! I really want to know more. Wish list on Steam now. <sighs> oh, dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Bum, bum, bow, bow. Um, oh, my goodness. Such a good, good start to this investigation. Okay, so let's see. All right, so that's it for this episode. Again, this game is called Paradise. Paradise Killer, and it is developed by Kaizen Gameworks and published by Fellow Traveler. Um, the demo is available via Ludonericon through May 1st, 2020. So if you are able to catch this video and it's still not May 1st, or if it's May 1st, I believe it goes through May 1st, uh, you can try this demo out for yourself. Because it's a time demo, you can play through it in an entirely different manner than I can. Um, what's kind of cool, like I was reading out loud taking a little bit more time so if I go back and play I could probably speed through and try and get a little bit further or talk to a few more characters uh, and you could do the same and if you're interested please do wishlist this game on Steam I think uh, for those who are fans of investigative games like this where you collect the evidence you really have to read not only the lines themselves, but perhaps in many cases read between the lines and sort of make your own guesses and assumptions um, about what is happening and what people's motives are. There is a potential for this game to be really fun through multiple playthroughs, which that's what has me really excited. Um, I like that these characters so far um, are all really interesting and very, like, flawed. <laughs> they all have like very distinct personalities and very distinct um, yeah, flaws and quirks that make them stand out and I'm really excited by that because it makes them more interesting to get to know and perhaps dig a little bit deeper into their backstories. Um, yeah, too much for one playthrough, I feel like. That's what this game is. It's, this is one that you'll probably want to dive into a couple of times. Um, I don't believe there is a release announcement or a release date yet. Let me see. Yeah, I don't see any release date on here. So um, just get excited and wishlist the game. And if you are interested in finding out more, do find um, these folks on Twitter and uh, let them know because that always is just really nice too. So that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed this, please consider following the channel. I do my best to cover indie games, typically of a, either narrative, wholesome, or I've noticed I do a lot of pixel art as well. So that is the type of stuff I usually find myself drawn to, um, you know, with occasional other types of games thrown in. But uh, you'll find a lot of more narratively focused games on this channel, a lot of games that, are, that tend toward the more wholesome. Um, yeah. So if you're interested in that, consider following. And if you would like even more, uh, I stream on Twitch Tuesdays and Wednesdays at 8.30 p.m. Pacific time, uh, covering games that I'm not able to cover on this channel. So there's only so much time in the day, only so much editing I'm able to do on top of my other work. So Twitch is really nice because it allows me to A, get to talk with you all in real time and hang out, and B, feature even more indie games. So if you'd like to tune in, um, please do because it's really fun. So that is it for today. I hope you all are having a wonderful day or night wherever you are and that you're finding lots of indie games and indie game demos to play. And I'll see you in the next video.